UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak will announce the largest ever military aid package to Ukraine during a visit to Poland. It includes boats, long-range storm shadow missiles, ammunition and armoured vehicles. Sunak will announce a massive increase in military support for Ukraine, including £500 million sterling in additional military funding and the largest ever delivery of vital equipment in the UK's history. Sunak will then travel to Germany to meet with Chancellor Olaf Scholz in Berlin. Ukraine is facing an existential threat as Russia continues its barbaric invasion, risking the security and stability of all of Europe. The £500 million additional funding announced, which takes us to £3 billion in UK military aid for Ukraine this financial year, will be used to rapidly deliver urgently needed ammunition, air defence, drones and engineering support, the British government said. The largest ever package of equipment from the UK includes 60 boats, including raid and dive boats, as well as naval guns, more than 1,600 strike and air defence missiles, as well as additional long-range storm shadow missiles, more than 400 vehicles, including 160 Husky protected mobility vehicles, 162 armoured vehicles and 78 all-terrain vehicles about 4 million rounds of ammunition for small arms. Defending Ukraine against Russia's brutal ambitions is vital for our security and for all of Europe. If Putin is allowed to succeed in this war of aggression, he will not stop at the Polish border, Sunak said. This record package of military aid will give President Zelensky and his brave nation more of the kit they need to kick Putin out and restore peace and stability in Europe. The UK was the first to provide NLAW missiles and the first to give modern tanks and the first to send long-range missiles. Now we are going even further. We will never let the world forget the existential battle Ukraine is fighting and with our enduring support, they will win, UK Defence Secretary Grant Shapps told. Russia plans to deploy ballistic missiles on Finnish border Threat to Europe is growing. Russian media reports that the Kremlin plans to deploy ballistic missiles close to its border with Finland. It's the latest in a series of military and hybrid threats that Russia has made against the Nordic state since it joined NATO in April last year in the wake of Moscow's invasion of Ukraine. The Russian newspaper Izvestia reported that a new brigade will be deployed in the Karelia region bordering Finland, equipped with an Iskander-M ballistic missile system. The Izvestia report quoted an ex-commander of Russia's Baltic fleet, Admiral Vladimir Valuev, who told the newspaper that the formation of a missile brigade is a very timely decision. This is an adequate response to Finland's accession to NATO. Despite the proximity to Finland, the potential deployment is not raising alarm bells in Helsinki, said security analyst Charlie Salonius Pasternak of the Finnish Institute of International Affairs. This is really not news, and of course, announcing a thing and then doing something about it are two very different things when it comes from Russia. So overall, we really haven't seen a lot other than rhetoric, he told VOA. Finland has warned that it is facing varied security and hybrid threats from Russia since it joined NATO. In the second half of 2023, following Finland's accession to the alliance, over 1,300 migrants from countries including Yemen, Syria and Somalia began to arrive at the Finnish-Russian border to try to claim asylum. Helsinki closed all crossing points along the frontier in November, accusing the Kremlin of weaponizing migration. They were reopened briefly, but swiftly closed again after another surge in migrant arrivals. The closure was extended indefinitely earlier this month. 
Finland wants the European Union to help in preventing any future migrant crisis. Finland is building a fence along part of the 1,340-kilometer border and increasing patrols. The government is debating legislation to block asylum seekers entering from Russia. Russia denies trying to create a migrant crisis on the Finnish border. Moscow has described Finland's accession to NATO as a historic mistake that would force it to take what it called countermeasures.